Hey y'all, well, my brain's on. I, I just want to start off by saying something. I played Pokemon Go today, y'all. I just want to tell you, uh, we've been playing it kind of religiously-ish. But, I'm leaving the gym around lunchtime. I go around the gym, yo, there's a fucking Pikachu and a Rhyhorn, you know I'm like, I'm finding this Pikachu. Speaking of Pokemon Go, I'm like, bro, I'm finding this fucking Pikachu. I did find this Pikachu, but Wait, tell me, hold on, hold on, let, let me, let me, let me, no, outside, like I'm okay. driving. Around the neighborhood, um, I ain't just in the gym, but I find a Pikachu. I'm like, oh my god, it's happened! It's happened. Here's the thing: I only had six Pokeballs left, cause I need. So I need to stop at a Poke Stop at a point. Like I probably gonna stop at one today, not to be ugly. Um, I get to the Pikachu. I'm like, cool. And this Pikachu's fucking the circles are red, so you know it's about to be hard. I'm like, all right, here we go. Hopefully, luck is with me. I throw these Pokeballs. I'm telling you, I had Libby. I perfectly threw these Pokeballs every time. Perfectly. This motherfucker kept coming out. When I get to my last ball, tell me why Pokemon Go is like, oh, you don't got one more ball. It says one. I'm ready for the picture. It says I have one ball left. This motherfucking ball ain't showing up. I'm like, bitch. Did y'all really just say I got one ball, but this ball ain't letting me, it ain't showing up. You ain't gonna let me catch this bitch? So, they fucked me over on the out of Pikachu. I was so pissed. Like, I was crying inside. Like, I showed her as she started on FAO. <laughs> I'm like, man, fuck you, bruh. Like, I, I was so beyond just pissed so supposedly the zoo has like 19 pokey stops and nine gyms or something shit like well, we're going to the zoo cause not to look at animals but to get some pokemon but i, I need to rack up my pokeballs because I, I won't have any more i'm already i'm half like i'm not even halfway to getting another level so it's gonna suck ass but i was so pissed but anyways how y'all feeling it's almost the weekend she gonna be off the whole weekend i almost said it doesn't mean anything to me but actually it does this week so Nothing. Uh, but yeah, we gotta go grocery shopping because it's well needed. I'm like, we're at dinner and going to the movies. I'm like, fuck you. <laughs> yeah, we need some groceries. We need some groceries because we, uh, yeah, we empty. But, so yeah. Taking y'all with us to Kroger, right? Kroger first? Then Is that the only store you're going to from what you got your coupon and done uh, and stuff? Yeah. Okay. All right. coupon's gonna suck this week. So we're, we're bargaining shop, bargaining, bargain shopping more than anything for groceries, you know, or shopping smart in a sense, but we still spent like $67. My thing is, is I feel but, like we try to eat healthy. Like I could get all of our groceries for $30 a week if we were eating ramen noodles, macaroni and cheese. Yeah, bad crap, you know, the stuff that's cheap and bad. You know, that's how it is, you know, that's how it is in this world, you know, the good stuff is more expensive. And Tortillas the, are two twenty nine. Yeah. spinach is two fifty. cheese was $1.88. Grapes We're, were 208, which we still is did really good, good deal. We still did good though. Okay, so grapes were on sale this week for 99 cents, and we saved four dollars and twenty cents. So those grapes would have been six dollars and twenty eight cents. Seriously? We spent 208. We should have got more. Yeah, that's really not bad at all. We we're going to Target and well, fresh time. Do you our grapes would have been more expensive than our sirloin steak. Grapes more expensive than some steak, dog. Get shit straight. I want to talk to you guys today about um, where me and Darius are yeah. mentally right now. That sounds so bad. Like, we're cool. We're good guys. Um, we're not in debt. Like, we don't owe people debt. We just have... We're in debt because we owe people stuff, but we're not, like, in collections. We just decided that at this point in our life, if we want to be able to get a house within the next year or two years if we want to be able to do things we need to better ourselves now so we are doing the gazelle method of debt relief so we are not buying anything like unless we need it we're not buying it so the only thing <sighs> sorry I really just woke up I'm so tired today um we're cutting back on things and unless we need it we're not buying it um, so we don't have cable anymore. Not because we cut back. Is that how you feel? Yeah. If that's how you feel, then go for it. Huh? I mean, come on. Do something about it. So the method that we're using, as much as we need it, we don't buy it. And the reason why we kind of started this is because, well, I started it. I'm the one that was like, we need to... I need to get my debt paid down because right now it's at a reasonable amount. Mine personally is a little over $3,000, which isn't bad. A lot of people have like $60,000 in debt. 
but there's no reason for me to have that much debt if I'm able to pay it off. Like I'm just being lazy and like my mind's not in the right place. So I'm paying that, that off. We got rid of the cable because we recently switched from one cable provider to a different cable provider. I'm not gonna bash anybody, but the cable that we recently got is shit. Like, and it's not the cable that's shit, but like, they came out, drilled a hole in the wall um, to be able to run a line, and then someone came back to bury the line, but ripped up the line. So we were out of cable for a week because they couldn't get somebody out. They came back out and people went back out. They couldn't get a technician out. Really? Really? Ouija, let me talk. Jesus, calm down. Um, and then it went out again in the bedroom and then we had to wait three days for a technician. So we were within the 30 day period and we're like, me and Darius sat down and we're like, we're not home. Like we're home, but like Darius is either on the Xbox and I'm on my computer or we're always on Netflix. Like we very rarely watch TV unless like it's on in the background for me to go to sleep. So we figured, why are we paying like $80 for something that is on in the background that we're not watching. So we got rid of it. We no longer have cable. Actually, the cable guy will be here today to take the boxes and then we won't have cable. Um, but what I'm telling you guys this is we are doing... You done? Okay. We're doing the gazelle method of debt saving. If you don't need it, you don't buy it. Um, so I'm telling you guys that is... For the next couple months, we're going to be boring, pretty much. Like, if it's not free, we're not doing it. Um, that's not true. So, we came up with a plan that we can reward ourselves, but we're not going to feel like we're not. So, all of our cash, like, income from our checks individually, on an extra, because we pay bills, clearly, um, from each of our checks goes to each of our debts. So, literally, every penny that I'm not using is going towards... A debt. I've shredded my credit cards at this point, so I'll put fifty dollars in my checking account. I mean, fifty dollars in my savings account now, just for like a backup, like a oh no, like I know I'm supposed to have more than that, but nothing really should pop up. I need some more. Um, that I'll need more than that within like the week frame. So I'll put some of it in my savings. Why are you yawn? Stop yawning, and beans. Um, and then. It's just going towards savings. So we've realized that in order to reward ourselves, change. We have a change jar. And whenever the change jar gets to like $10, we can go to the movies or something. Because movies here are only like 12 bucks. Um, and we have a reward card so we get free tickets often. So like in order to do like things on Sundays, so we would do it. We can stop biting me. What is wrong with you? Stop. Sorry, I feel like this video is everywhere. Um, in order to do things, it has to be $10 or less um, for cash, or we can use our change jar to, like, go to the movies. Like, it's not that hard to save up $12 to change. God, I feel like I should record this whole clip again because I'm yawning, beans, it's biting people. I'm, so, um, we're going to be around, but we're not going to be like, here's my vlog at the zoo. Here's my vlog at the aquarium like it's gonna be like we're at the park walking around looking for pokemon like small things like that it's not gonna be big vlogs like going back to niagara falls and like vacation vlogs like for a while it's gonna be minimal um but just a heads up if you guys notice that in the next couple vlogs i got a planner i searched and searched and searched for a planner that had columns if I can, you know, get a hold of my life. Um, that had columns like this. 90% of columns that you see have them this way, and I don't like it at all. This is kind of like an Erin Codron planner, the way it's set up. Um, my boss actually bought this for me because I was talking about it, and I was going to go buy it for myself, but I didn't yet. Um, so this is going to help me get, like, a grip on my life, like, plan things out, make sure I'm organized. Um, so today's schedule is to do laundry, which I've already started. Organize the whole closet, which is that one, because I'll show you guys. Oh, my finger is so focused, which is why aren't you, that one, because it's 
atrocious. And then create a grocery list. Create a grocery list because we're going grocery shopping tomorrow. And then I'm off work. Give Ouija bath if I have extra time and make manor, make planner stickers on my Cricut. And then tonight we're having chicken sausage pasta. It might be chicken sausage rice. I'm not sure. Best part. No. When they sticky, icky, icky. In my mind. <laughs> what? Oh, never mind. <laughs> I got a big weed stash, rocket full of cash, just seen it. It's Saturday. Sticky. <laughs> Did I say it's Saturday? I'm sure it's hard to see. Huh? Did I say it's, it's Saturday?